New tonight at 5, an Alabama driver is in jail after Coweta County deputies say that they found a large amount of the drug fentanyl in his car. That's what drug health experts have connected to a huge spike in drug overdose cases in many communities across North Georgia. Fox 5's Doug Evans has more on the traffic stop. Coweta County deputies say Tori LeVar Robinson was speeding 100 miles an hour down Interstate 85. On the body cam video, you can hear him tell deputies a couple of times that there are no guns or drugs in his car. Deputies say they found both, including the drug fentanyl, which has been linked to a sharp increase in drug overdoses in North Georgia. We're going to Coweta County Jail, okay? Where you'll be. On the body cam video, a patrol deputy places Tory LeVar Robinson under arrest after he says he discovered a backpack with two packages of marijuana and a package of white powder. At the time, he thought it might be cocaine, wasn't sure. Uh, gets it to the jail and tests it, and it becomes back as fentanyl. The Coweta County Sheriff's Office says it clocked Robinson at nearly 100 miles an hour on Interstate 85. The Phoenix City, Alabama man says he was headed to see his girlfriend in Union City. The deputy reported smelling the odor of marijuana in the car. The body cam video shows a search of his center console uncovered a gun that deputies say would come back stolen from Alabama. The marijuana and fentanyl discovered in the trunk in a backpack. Deputies say there was more than eight ounces of fentanyl, which they say is a drug used to mix with other drugs to make them more potent, often leading to overdoses, medical intervention, and death. Very deadly, very serious. You know, it destroys just not families, but communities. Um, it's, you know, my reference to it earlier was I've uh, been policing since the 80s, and it's like the new crack. It, uh, it brings something to the table that's devastating. Robinson is 40 years old and facing drug and weapons charges. He's being held in the Coweta County Jail without bond. I'm Doug Evans, Fox 5 News. Again, law enforcement agencies citing a rash of fentanyl-laced drugs around North Georgia in the recent weeks, and people have taken action. In DeKalb County, there have been 50 accidental overdose deaths so far this year, and eight of them involved fentanyl-laced cocaine. The uptick prompted a bar in Little Five Points to host a Narcan event to teach people how to administer the overdose reversal drug as well as take a kit for free. 